Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, pirates of all ages, here we are with another episode in I spent $7,000 on one 10 by 30. I, I have never, ever, ever been so excited as I am right now to go through a unit and look for the second time. I came here last night, I started, I got after hours, so I'm working on it, and I found amazing stuff. I hope you saw part one, but here we are gonna be on part two. There's gonna be several parts of this because I could see just nothing but boxes, but what I saw in those first 12 to 15 boxes, I've never been more intrigued to come back to a unit for another time. I was nervous, waited a week to go through the unit. Then when I got here, I opened up one thing, I stopped, I opened up one thing, I stopped. You guys saw the video. Anyway, here we are, we're about to get started on part number two. All right, so we had an accident here already and everything fell out of that box everything came tumbling down this is the unit this is what we got started so far looks like lots of stuff in here we found Louisville slugger bat Louisville slugger bat mickey mantle bat hank aaron bat johnny bench bat bats 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 we found canes with gold and silver on them very nice stuff I, I just here's a quick peek of what we saw in the last one just cool stuff sucks because this all just fell right here like i couldn't do nothing about it as soon as i opened the door everything fell out on me i'm gonna pick it up all up on the table and i'll show you what was in that box right off the bat we're gonna start here with the first box being something cool i don't know what these are they look like they're reproduction things made to look like big lures but nonetheless they're pretty nice maybe they are real lures i really don't know the answer to that question they're big they're massive uh you can see them next to a dvd then we got a indoor rifle competition 1934 First price won by Corporal C.C. Stewart. I don't know about this stuff here. Another large lure. Once again, I don't know if these are decoration or if they're really meant to be catching a fish. That is a huge lure, if so. Then we have another state rifle competition. 1936, second prize. Can't tell, I don't think that's silver, but It's nice. This is kind of cool. The Gambler Lane Hawk. Maybe it's a bowling ball that's uncut. I like it. It's a cool pattern. We got a fencing helmet. Post sport fencing post. We got a golf trophy here. Fern Club of W States 1949 presented by Fern Fast Freight. Nice trophy. And then we got this hourglass. I'm keeping that baby right there. There's a much nicer hourglass than I ever had. And it looks like it's in a pirate fashion. Okay. Uh, apologize if you guys got mad that stuff was laying on the ground, but come on now. Um, first box out, $7,000 unit, part two. Look at all this goodies. Ooh. Not the bat, there's a bag. We'll set that over here for a minute. These blankets are uncanny. I can't tell if they're Native American. Let's look them all. Let's pull them all. Guys, I, I don't even. This is nuts. This looks like a Native American blanket to me. I don't know. I have no idea about any of these. You can see my foot's about a foot, so this will be a good measure next to how big each one is. Um, try not to step on them. They have... This is crazy. What do you guys know about these rugs right here? I'm going to need a lot of help on this unit. Game Boy Advance, the North Face, shorts, clothes, a razor, Nikon camera. You got to be careful with everything. Oop, I found. 17 cents. Could have been Michaela's, but she didn't want to get the car. Towel Sterling. <laughs> wow. A 
fish that's cheap. Another fish with a three dollar price tag. Stuff is really well wrapped. That is kind of cool. That'll go in the good box. We're kind of separating things like good, decent, get looked at. Chintzy, cheesy, two, three bucks. Oh, wow. Look at this. That is tight. I never seen anything like that. <laughs> wow, that is dope. Ooh, we gotta take very good care of that. Be very careful. That's kind of cool. It's nothing special, but it's cool. We got classic Hot Wheels. Not red lines, but in 1969. We'll put those aside in our good pile once again. We're, we're extremely separating right off the bat. We got so much things to do. Cool, cool. What is this? Uh, brass is still cool. I thought those were silver. Sombreros. A little sombrero collection. Possibly ashtrays. Vintage. Nice. It's not this, the normal baseball Louisville Slugger motif we was with yesterday. We're kind of into a, maybe this is the wife stuff. Maybe. Little trinkets, those look cool. This one looks reproduction. It actually said 1949, I stand corrected. Another little wiener dog. I probably should have said it. We'll take that off. It's just a dog. Look at that. Woo! Tonka toys. This is nice stuff, guys. Maybe that's 60 bucks. Maybe that's 80 bucks. Maybe it's 20 bucks. I'm gonna have to look that up. Tonka Toys, Mound, Minnesota. It might possibly have more parts to it. Oh, the duck collection is coming out now. This one had a sticker on it, so it's most likely store-bought. Ooh. You guys are the ones that are the greatest human beings. I love you guys out there, all you, each and every one of you. That's great right there. That was great. Sometimes, ooh, what do we got here? Konica G35, Konica EE Matic Deluxe, another 35 millimeter camera. We found several of those so far. Uh, I don't know the price on those. I have not sold the Konica ones. I don't believe they're super expensive, but I could be wrong. Crystal inside of a boot. It's my homie Alex right there. Hmm. John Deere. Nice. Okay. Oh, not only that, but we got a Waterford. What's this is? I love when you're living this life and you got Waterford Christmas ornaments. This is un freaking believable, right there. God bless America. That is, that's everything right there. This looks like uh, something spe special right here. I don't know. 
we're going to have to take a look into that right there. Some Sometimes booze are very expensive. You guys are seeing some of the coolest stuff I've ever found in storage. You know, I've already in my gut, like, feel like this has the potential to become the best unit I've ever bought. Like, literally, as I stand here right now, the only thing rushing through my van, right through these eyes, I'm looking like this at the unit right here has the potential to become the best unit I've ever bought. You guys have seen me buy some major units over the years. Wow. It's empty, but I just love that Romeo Y. Julieta. If you guys know anything about the pirate, you know he loves a good love story. And this is my favorite Shakespeare poem, story, novel, whatever. All right, baby girl, before you leave to go do what you're going to do, I want to, uh, when I was here yesterday by myself, there was the world's biggest black widow. Now, I'm not scared of the spider, but what I need you to do is watch my back in case it comes around me with a juke move and I can't see it coming. I need you to protect me. So, we're going to do this fast and efficient. Now we're coming. Watch out. It's probably inside of there. Okay, look underneath. Oh, heck no. Ah! Yeah? Ah! Oh, it's my. Ah! Ah! Where? Oh. Take the phone! I told you, no, I gotta get. Ah! Oh my god! Oh my god! No, I cannot be this close to it! Ah! Ah! We're gonna get him, alright? Ah! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. I'm Come so here. I'm gonna save right your now. life if you work with me here. If you make this difficult. I will kill you. Come on. Ah! You can't jump. I'm not satisfied with this right now at all. Come on, get on the broom. Push it the other way. Ah! 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 See that? Yeah. You like that? No. Spider whisper. You should have killed it. Back in the day, I would have. I am scared for my entire life. I'm leaving right now. I'm leaving. Bugs he was eating. Look at that. Uh, one of these rugs. This one is... I don't know. A lot of dog hair. No, store bought. That was good. That was easy to tell. Okay. Flowers. This is a nice butcher block right here. I like it's not. It's, it's a little bigger than mine. You guys know when I cook a lot, I use one of these. Nice. That's gotta be 100 maybe? I would say 100, maybe 80. Then right here we have pretty much the best DeWalt saw there is, I think. I think this is like an easy 150, $200 sale here. It's got all the parts there. Good shape. I'm gonna ask 200 bucks for it, be kind of firm. I'm not desperate to make my money back, but I would like to make some money on this storage. It's been a while since I found something. With this type of oomph. Rap who has really, literally got on everything. It's kind of disgusting. This is nice right here. Ooh. This is money. I don't know how much, but let me unzip. This is a military bomber jacket. Flying man's intermediate type one. These two are doing good money right now that I'm pretty aware of. Could be wrong. A work vest. A hunting vest. Not work vest. Carhartt. That's a very good brand right there. Columbia. Another good brand. Urban Outfitters. And do we have one more bomber jacket? Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Not sure, once again, this is a military issue. This one is pretty good. <laughs> oh my. 
Sorry guys, this is like freaking, we put all this stuff out. Oh, let me get this out of here in there. There was this nice little piece of glass here. Carnival glass maybe they call it. Makeup, eh? Mm, not even good makeup. We got a lamp here. Thought that was kind of cool, I guess. It didn't sound very promising when I picked it up. But what are you gonna do? Deck of cards, that's the way life is. It's a freaking gamble. I love it. Sometimes you gotta put the hammer down and just go all in. Loving it. That's jewelry. That's what we wanna start finding. Look at that, a military pen or something? Cravers. It would be for a Rolex. Something feels like it's crawling on my leg, it's a bug. Kind of cool. Meritus service. All right, looks like this right here. That's kind of cool. Military. Ooh. My eyes deceive me. Is there more here? Notice how I didn't bag. We're going to save this till the end. Nope, not today. This unit is pretty cool, and I don't feel like we need to like try to leave this with the cliffhanger to get you to the end, because I think every box in this unit is just wow. Doesn't matter what it is, even the clothes boxes. A little bit of costume. We'll just keep setting all that aside with the rest of our costume. That's kind of hope cool. Actually. Interesting. Room, buffalo hide. This is kind of trippy. Is there like really a genuine buffalo hide in this mother? Oh, it's a pillow. No, that is a buffalo hide. What the? Uh, wow. I got a buffalo. This is nuts. <laughs> wow. This is crazy. Come on, be his collection of rare 1982 G.I. Joe in the box. Or be jackets. Some type of hunting. Got another Carhartt. The Dickies. Filson Garmin. I got so much stuff I don't even know what to do. I gotta look up though. I feel like that's money right there. That's a vintage tag right there. That right there has to be some form of good money. Wolverine workwear. Hold on, let me lay all these out now. That's pretty cool right there. <laughs> Just one second, guys. I can't I can't even it's just, I was so excited of all this stuff. Uh, that is a Native American. Uh, I think that's a gun holder right there. Probably Native American. It's nice bags, that rug. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this right here. Just wow. <sighs> Guys, I'm freaking going bananas here. <laughs> like, I I have a dream of finding things like this. I don't even know what this is. WNY New York City JHCV Look at the detail in this trench art on this shell right here. You guys, this is unbelievable right here. This is the type of stuff that I would I would contemplate keeping this stuff right here. It's insane. I can't even fathom the amount of time put into this work. They call this trench art. This is a bullet shell missile case. I don't know what you would call them. What do we got here? Another one. NNY. <sighs> this is crazy. <laughs> I 
another trench art piece right here it's a bullet shell 50 caliber turned into a coffee cup because that's how they do it i don't even know what these are right here are these the actual holders for them is this this is crazy military stuff right here this is <clears throat> i don't even know what to say about any of this guys gonna totally need some help on every single thing in this unit Look at that. Rawlings. Rawlings 001447. That's cool, man. What is all of this? Even their backpacks are dope. Their backpacks are dope. Friends. Made in Italy. Genuine leather. I mean, when you got even your bags are tight we got i don't know what to say samsonite that's all right man even the bags are tight i gotta slow down i keep trying to speed up and get things going but i can't i gotta take my time this looks like a nice one too made in italy ah that is not what my a-rod looks like shout out to alex Colt 45 automatic. What is that? I wouldn't mind finding a Colt 45, would I? You want to find a Colt 40? Oh, the infamous skill saw mag 77. That's probably like a hundred bucks right there. That's an easy, easy hundred bucks right there. Good shape. Comes in a nice skill saw box. Hmm. Dang. JB's got a fishing weight and a hook. We'll have to have this one looked at. We well, haven't even gone in that wood box right there. I'm just so intrigued by everything. Okay, where can we go in the world today? Because I want to go somewhere in the world. I just want to do this right here. And be like, nope, we're not going there again. So this, this game is not working out well. We're going to set all this stuff in this box out here real quick. And then we're going to look at it up close. Come on, Leica. Oh, Pentax ME Super. 35 millimeter with the Sakar Sacker F70 millimeter. I don't know. I forget what this one is worth. I have to have that. Going right in the good pile. We'll look all this up, each and everything, because this stuff is quality pieces here. Come on, Leica. I haven't found a Leica in forever. <laughs> Harold's calling, but yeah, we got a Nikon. Pronia 6i with a Nikon lens. Don't know much about that one. And then when here, come on Leica. Can keep saying Leica until we find a Leica. So we like Leica, Leica, Leica. Ooh, what do we got here? It says Canon EOS on the handle. Be a good one. Hmm. Never seen this one. Canon T70. With a Etna Row Kona MC Auto Lens. Nice. These are all eBay items. Let's see what else we have in here. More importantly than the cameras sometimes are just the lenses. Often misunderstood. We like Canon. We like Nikon. We can... I would find Nikon and Canon all day long. Sigma, 80 millimeter for that Canon. And then we have one more here, which is a 
cannon. Dang, these things are not easy to get out. We gotta be careful. I get yelled at in the comments right now. Canon 50 FD millimeters. Canon. Nice. I think that was a good little score in this little camera set here. I have my eye on each and every one of y'all. Why? Because I love y'all. And I want to say thanks for watching these videos. Don't forget the like button, the share button, and subscribe. And let me know what your favorite piece I've had, had in this video right here was. And let me know if you think anything was worth over a thousand bucks. There was a lot of nice items. I'm trying to find something, one item that's over seven grand that pays for this unit. You have to stay tuned. This is part two. There should be at least eight nine more parts because i'm trying to take my time give you guys the full entirety of what it's like when you spend seven thousand dollars on one unit and what you must find to make your money back i love y'all ah